hello friends uh, welcome again and uh, this is my new project order management system and i have developed this project in java and mysql uh, the jdk version i am using is the jdk version 1.8 and the mysql version is 5.6 for connecting java with mysql i am using the mysql java connector which you will get easily from the mysql.org website and this is a swing based uh, windows based application and i am using the netbeans id for developing this project right so this is a windows based swing application right so you can also say this is a core application core java application where i i have used the swing components for developing this project like for test box uh, the drop downs and the buttons i have used the swing plugins i have not used any type of awt and applet plugins for developing this project right so let's start with the project functionality go through so the project title is order management system and it's a mini dbms project developed in java and mysql right i i am using the that means version 8.2 for developing this project right so for running this project you need to open this project in the netbeans id and after that just click on this play button once you click on the play button you will get a login form right so this is a login form and uh, using this login form you will be able to log in so the user id has been admin and password is test so once you log in inside the system you will get the login dashboard sorry admin dashboard so these operation admin can perform admin can add the product admin can see the product report admin can add the cells admin can see the cells report about project and logout and exit right so let me go through one by one so this click on add product so this is a product management form here there are five uh, six sorry there are five fields i have added for adding the products right so product name cost and this all products i have added if you want to add any product just enter the things here right cost per unit is 10 right and once you click on the save product then that product will be saved and currently you are seeing the four products here in the list but once you click on the ok then you will get the next product here right if you want to edit it just click on the line row and after that you will get the option for editing or deleting the record once you click on the edit record then you will be able to update the record here right you can see and once you click on the save product then after clicking on the ok that product will be updated right you can see that product has been updated right so once you click on this product if you want to delete it just click on the delete record and after that that record will be deleted successfully right so this is the product management form from where you can add any number of products right just click on the cancel right this is a product report this is a list view of the product so all of the product which you added will be displayed here so currently i have four products right if you want to add more just you can add product from the add product section right just click on close this is a add sales so this is a sales dashboard from where you can add the sales so for creating the sales you need to enter the customer name and the mobile number first right so customer name suppose i am entering jay kumar and after that mobile number and just click on the start billing once you click on the start billing you will get this dashboard right here this drop down will contain all of the products which you have added into the database using the add product form right so just click on the select the product and quantity right i am adding the one quantity and after that just uh, three right that product add and cost will be calculated automatically right you can see here i'll just come on here just one and click on the add right so once you click on that that is the sales right if you want to delete the item just click on that row and click on the delete yes once you click on the delete then that uh, uh, so that product will be deleted from the you can say uh, the list right and if you want to add more just click on the add more item right so total cost is total 150 rupees right once you click on the save and order and exist then this order will be saved into the database and you can see the details in the order history page right just click on the save and exit right this is sales report all of the sales which you have made will be displayed here you can see there are the last sale one is the jack mark for the order id number 31 and mobile number this this and the total amount collected from the jack is 150 rupees right just click on the close and this is about project right you can change the content you can add your names you can change the image here and the, this is a totally static uh, frame if you want to change the content you can change it from the about.java right log out and exit once you click on the log out and exit then this window will be closed closed and your 
uh, you can rerun the project for accessing the application right so this all application i have developed inside this project right if you need more functionality inside this project just put it into the comment i will incorporate those changes i will make this project more better and better according to your requirements and don't forget to subscribe our channel for getting the latest projects videos and the latest technologies thanks for watching the video thank you very much